hello youtube welcome to my channel so in this video today i am going to be doing a wig review so the wig review that i'm going to be doing is on my head so first before i get into it thank you so much guys for the new subscribers i have been getting a lot of new subscribers and i just want to say i appreciate you guys thank you so much and thank you for the ones who has been following me for a while thank you i know i haven't really been posting i've been really busy with work and i've been sick off and on so but now i'm back so welcome back to my channel and thank you for the new subscribers i appreciate you guys so let's get into the video so in this video today i am going to be reviewing this wig that i have on my head this is a wig i have a lot to say about this wig and i'm not sure about this wig it either so but let's get into the video so the wig that i am reviewing is called um what is this wig called it's called wet and wavy wig and this is um what is the name of this wig okay this is a it's a wig i guess that's the name it's a wig okay so this is what it is i know my accent is a little off so that's what it is and this is the wig that i got on this is the wig that i have in my head today so um this is a itch itch partless wet and wavy so i don't know what an itch itch is part wig so i'm guessing they're talking about this part right here so this is a wig this is not a lace frontal this is just straight up a, a human hair wig and this is 100 percent brazilian human hair so this is a brazilian human hair wig and it's fast easy to wear styles so let's get into this video so number one i bought this hair for 125 dollars a waste of money this is why first of all this hair is not worth 125 dollars this is more like maybe a 50 to 60 dollar type of hair because um i'm gonna just state my honest review about this hair i'm not making no money i don't have no permission promotion i don't have nothing this is just my honest review on this hair so this hair costs 125 dollars out of my local beauty supply store i don't know if because everything has been going up things have gotten expensive wigs hair everything has gotten expensive i don't know this is why they charge so much for this hair but this hair was just way too much and i don't know what i was thinking but i purchased it because instead of me waiting seven to ten business day you know from purchasing a hair online i went ahead and just uh purchased this out of my local beauty supply store because it is uh fast fast and easy but um 125 dollar hair a waste of money to be honest with you when i first stick this hair out of the package this hair was it was very dry and knotted up like i don't know because it been in this box for so long but it was just too dry and it looks a little bit nappy so but i didn't want to waste 125 dollars so i wanted to make it work and up to this day i still don't like this hair i'm going to give you guys the pros and cons of this hair but right now this is the the coin i guess the bad well let me just say i'm going to give you the bad and good review of this hair so let's just get into the bad because there's a lot of more bad stuff than actually good stuff okay so um this is what the hair looks like and this you can wear it side part or you can wear it you know middle part i choose to wear a side part because i feel like it looks more better and more natural looking than actually wearing it in the front if you wear it in the middle it looks straight up like a wig if you wear it on the side i mean it look like a wig but you can you can get you can get away with it so um that's one of the reason why i decided just to wear on the side because it looks more natural than actually being in the middle so this hair guys shed so much this hair shed so much i don't know what it is i have had human hair in um 
I have had human hair, human hair do shed, but it doesn't shed that much. But this hair sheds so much. If you put your hands through it, there is hair coming off. Like it sheds so much. And I feel like this is not 100% human hair. I feel like they have synthetic hair blended in with this hair because there's no reason why I should be getting so much shedding out of this hair. So if you are looking to purchase this hair, you need to really think about it because it sheds like hell. Okay, and a number one thing is um, this hair is wet and wavy. It's water friendly or whatever. Um, but I had to do a lot to it to get this curl. So it just doesn't work with water. When you pour water on it, it will get curly. But you got to mix it with stuff to keep the curls popping like this. So I'm going to show you guys how I keep the curls popping. But let me just talk about this hair first, okay? So when I took out the hair out of the box, this is what the hair pattern look like. It looks a little like, you know, brushed out or whatever. It doesn't look as curly, you know, um, on the model, you know, because I thought that the hair was gonna be super curly, but when I took it out, this is exactly how the curl pattern look. This is, um, it's a it's a nice curl pattern but um i just don't like how they make the hair this is not a human hair it's human hair but i feel like it's blended with something else but let's get into the the curling part so what i did to get this curl pattern is i got my water you know i got some curl maker or whatever so this is what i use for the hair and i also got my my brush or whatever so you know i just spray some water like a lot a lot a lot of water on the hair just to get it really like wet and then i take about five pumps of this and i just rub it in my hand and just you know uh make just rub it in my hand really good and rub it on the hair to get the curls to pop a little bit and as the hair was wet i used my brush and brush through it and make sure that each section of the hair get the this product and then i take a hair blow dryer i blow out the hair i dry out the hair and i was able to get this curl pattern because i don't like how this curl looks so i wanted it more like this because i feel like it looks more natural in this state so um that's what i did to get this curl pattern so um this hair takes water very well and it also reacts to product very well and i take a little bit of oil just to get the shine out of this hair so that's just one thing that i also did um this is not a lace frontal you just this is just like a wig you put it on you go you don't need too much you don't need to do too much of this hair um this is a uh, uh this is a lace wig the under lace is right here you don't need to glue anything down you don't need to do none of that you just put it on you adjust your um your your comb so this hair comes with a comb it comes with i believe it comes with a comb in the front and two comb on the side so i didn't get to use any of that comb i just put it on i made sure that i adjust the straps in the wig and I just put it on and style it. So um, so far, this is um, you can iron this hair. You can wear this hair straight if you like. I don't know how it is. I don't know how it react um, with a iron or whatever. I haven't tried it, but I will try it when I get tired of this hair. But um. You can wear this hair two way. You can wear it like this, or you can flat iron it to wear it straight. Um, once again, this is one hundred twenty five dollars. Not worth it. I don't know what I was thinking, but I just wanted something uh, quick and easy. So this is a real human hair. It says it's not blended with no other texture hair. So this is just straight Brazilian human hair, natural hair. Okay, and this is uh, unpressed prayer natural. I don't know what that means. And, um, yep, so this is what I was reading offered on the back. And, um, 
this is what the box of the hair looks like you know um nothing too dramatic simple as other wigs and this is what the um the package look like it just have a little bit of information of the hair and it gives you tips on the back of this hair um but the good thing about this hair it hold curls pattern really good it's water friendly and it's product friendly um the thing about this hair it just sheds a lot and i feel like this is not 100 percent human hair i feel like it's blended with other stuff but they say it's 100 brazilian hair so i'm gonna just go with the package but um would i be purchasing this hair again absolutely not it's not worth it but um i just wanted to come on camera give you guys my honest review i'm not getting paid for this i'm not trying to bash any company hey i pay for this hair with my own money so i want to just give you guys a review just in case somebody come across this hair get the review first before you're going to spend that kind of money okay but um i hope you guys like this video thank you guys so much for work uh watching this video like share comment subscribe and um click on the notification bell uh i will be trying to upload more videos hopefully uh once a week now but um that's the plan but i just wanted to come and give you guys my own review of this hair so as i run my hand to this hair i mean the hair is pretty soft um it's nice it holds curl pattern very well i don't know how many inches this hair is it looks like this hair is maybe 14 inch i'm not sure but as i run my finger through it there's no like tangle or whatever like that because i did a lot of brushing to this hair y'all like i did a lot to this hair so this is what this hair is looking like i'm gonna go ahead and turn around so you guys can see the back as i turn around this is what the back is looking like okay so i hope you guys like this video don't forget to like share comment and subscribe and click on that notification bell and i will be talking to you guys later bye bye